This is a steel green machine. It's a 2020 steel green machine. It's a spreader sprayer unit. Greg is the operator. Hey, Greg. And this has two tanks uh, that hold 20 gallons each. And then it has a third tank over here. No, nope, just two. Oh, we got a third tank that holds seven gallons. So this machine has three tanks, two 20 gallons and a seven gallon tank. This bucket right here holds a bag of fertilizer. That's the stand. You get up on the machine and you're looking out. That's a spreader. It holds this right here is a spreader. It holds 220 pounds of fertilizer. These are the valves that turn on the pumps. That's for the left. This is for the middle. This is for the right. You can spray all three. And we're good to go. This is the pressure valve. Pretty cool. We got an instrument panel. We got um, the hopper controls right here. We got how fast and slow we want to go. That's fast. That's slowing down. We have our auxiliary. One, two, three. And our pump that makes the pump spray. Then we have our pressure spray. How much uh, pounds of pressure we have. We have start. Electric start. Here's our tachometer. Shows how many hours are on the machine. We have this lever right here. That turns the hopper. Pattern control. We have another one over there. And this opens the hopper. Opens the uh, and opens and closes the gate. We have a little hose reel over here so we can spray uh, further away from the machine. We have right and left suction tank controls for these green tanks. We're going to spray the machine. We're going to spray from the nozzles. So we're just spraying water in here. But you can see that spraying. Now we're going to do the middle and the two middle ones and the left. So that's what that looks like when it sprays. On off. And he's doing it by controlling those levers. Switch a lever. Sprays that. Middle, sprays the middle two. And then the third one is the far left or right if you're on Greg's side. So that's what a Z-spray does. I mean, a uh, steel green sprayer, and uh, that's how it operates. Thanks, Greg. Have a good day.